we're testing the speed capabilities of this very versatile solid carbide drill, the Go Drill, against this material specific solid carbide drill, the HPX Solid Carbide Drill for Steels. Based on the application recommendation for both drills, we're taking both drills to their limits. For the Go Drill, we're looking at a speed of 140 meters per minute and a feed rate of 0.35 millimeters per revolution. The HPX drill is being applied with a speed of 270 meters per minute and a feed rate of 0.61 millimeters per revolution. That's almost double the feed rate of what we'll be running the Go Drill at. Each drill is going to drill 14 holes in a block of 4140 steel. Let's go. Doubling the feed rate is one thing, but also look at the increased cutting speed. Taking these two parameters into consideration, we see a productivity increase of more than 200%. The GO drill had just finished a few holes by the time the HPX drill was completely finished. The actual material cut time for these 14 holes is 30 seconds for the GO drill and just 9 seconds for the HPX drill. Now, we know that it's not possible to drill a hole this deep, but if we were to drill one very deep hole for one minute, instead of creating multiple holes exiting and re-entering the material, the GO drill would have created a 1.3 meter deep hole. The HPX drill would have created a 4.3 meter deep hole. Here's the takeaway. If you have many different materials to drill on a daily basis, and you only need one drill that is capable of doing it, the Go Drill is your best friend. A true versatile solid carbide drill, very productive in many materials. But if speed is all that matters when drilling steels, the HPX drill with its material specific low thrust drill point is the way to go. Thanks for checking out the versatile Go Drill and the HPX drill for steels. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos.